What up, y'all? It's your boy Gangs Gangs G Way hollering back at you. What up? All right, uh, real quick, let me do. Uh. Got my head to show y'all my little Corona protection. Notice the little G Way in it. Uh, you want to say something in the comments? I'll shoot you an inbox to a link um, to a website on Facebook that they make them for you. They custom make them, you know. Uh, anyway, anyhow, anywho out here in um, Fort Campbell, still on my military stuff. Uh, well, got lucky and blessed to get one. Uh, look for a load all day. I just got my overhead done on the truck. Uh, got to move the truck up so I'll holler back. What up, y'all? Back at you again. Didn't finish the last video. Anyway, long story short, I am in New Jersey now. Um, yeah, that load went well. Um, I pushed it, made it do what it do. Cause I had booked another load to make my icing on the cake this week. Cause that that load I pulled was my how you said um was my quota with that much icing on it. You know what I'm saying? So I had booked another load to make it that much icing. You know what I'm saying? So I'm wondering. I'm sitting here like, okay, he just sent me the freight bill, but it's not in land style. In other words, I can't advance off of it. Um, it's not showing my delivery date or my follow follow me loads not coming up. You know, yeah, the B, everybody picked it the bees, but the bee are growing nicely. See, 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 see. But um doggone. So I called, I'm like, yo, all right, I'm empty. You know, I'm at Fort Dix getting unloaded. So I can hurry up and do this little 75 mile day ahead and go pick up his load. They head to Texas. Long story short. He said, you got to call Landstar. Something wrong with their system. I call Landstar. Landstar finally gets him on the phone. Uh, he assigned it to the wrong driver. And then come to find out, he had to call me back and take the load off of me. Because apparently they booked the government load they weren't supposed to book. Dealing with, hey, buddy. I should have known better. But, you know, hey, it's the best thing paying getting up out of here. You know. But anyway, anyhow, who? The reason I'm making this little clip, it is 2.40 in the afternoon. I'm about to be stuck in Jersey, a hot area. So I'm looking for a load to get out of here. Uh, actually, I just saw a load going to College Park. It was only paying $1.92 a mile, and it's due tomorrow. So I ain't got enough time on my clock left today anyway. So I'm looking for something I can pick up today and stroll over the weekend. But we'll see how it turns out, y'all. I'll holler back, yo. What up, y'all? Back at you again. I hear petrol. Uh somewhere around mile marker 31 going 31 south on 81 81 been my lane here lately um matter of fact on my way back to the house um before i came out this time 81 was the lane and I had picked up this government load 81 the lane and actually like i told y'all in the last clip the plan was the government load was like this you know what i'm saying I had booked me a load to put icing on the cake like that. You know what I'm saying? On top of the cake, you know? But uh, like I say, the load got canceled, whatever, whatever. Some of these agents do some shiesty junk, you know. Um, always call your BCO advisor or, um, my bad, Landstar Customer Service, not contractor service, customer service. And they'll handle a lot of that bull crap for you. Um, matter of fact, I ended up getting a truck not used out of it. You probably wasn't going to get it to me. But after last stock got involved, yeah. But um, yeah. So I got stuck. I say, well, let me sit around. I actually I did hit it down to um, right across the Maryland line. That TA right there. Y'all know I'm a TA petrol fan. You know, you get them good breaks there. And plus, I build up a lot of showers though. So um, set it down there and said to myself, well, listen, if I stay here tonight wake up in the morning if a couple of things pop on the board you know i can get some out i'll be stuck over the weekend i just knew i had to get out of jersey and pennsylvania which is two hot areas right now um so last night the email came across saying agent booked the load um he said he can't promise us nothing you know because it was about, i don't know about a 30 truck move two agencies um oh almost looking gay out of agent cool <laughs> Hey, I'm finding out a couple of good ones. But anyway, um, sent an email out saying, can't promise nothing, but look like the government going to move some more stuff. 
um, out of Campbell. So, um, if y'all feel free to be back in the area, do so. Um, he say he ain't promising nothing. And, you know, it was the weekend. Hell, I had enough fuel left over, um, getting it real cheap out here on 81 at the P Petro GA. Um, matter of fact, I just filled up now. Um, hell, I want to say I got it for $1.86 a gallon. Ain't bad. But long story short, um, I'm dead heading back towards Nashville. Um, knocking out a couple hours a day on the baiting, taking my 30 on the baiting. Should I knock out the rest or should I just, you know, do the rest tomorrow? Either way it go, I got to do the rest tomorrow. I ain't got enough hours to do it today. Um, I can get damn close, <laughs> but nobody's pushing it that hard. Um, hopefully I'll get another turnaround and, um, I want to be well rested because on that Corvette load, you know, you get that, um, that government waiver, baby. <laughs> DOT waiver. That clock out the door. But, um, yeah, but it's serious stuff. Serious stuff. But that's a little update on me. I'm going to go ahead and, um, make up my mind. We're going to shut it down. Um, everything different out here now with the COVID. Um, coronavirus, everything. Numbers going through the roof. Um, matter of fact, Louisiana, a hot spot now. Hot spreads go out to everybody, you know. Um, yeah, truck stops ain't the same no more. You can't really get nothing to eat. Um, yeah, they do do take out on a very limited menu. Uh, it's just different out here now. Um, matter of fact, when I go back in, the wife made a little run. We'll stop back cooking in my truck. I got my app cooking, my skillet. You know, when it got four new batteries, you know, when I got my overhead done. Um, so I'm good on that. I ain't got to worry about draining my full of batteries. But that's what it is. That's the guys' video for this week. I'll keep y'all posted on the next thing. Hit like, hit subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, um, Nathan Galloway. Follow me on Instagram, Gangster G 1969. Gangster G, Gangster G 1999. And um, hey, I'm still on that Fortnite, baby. <laughs> All right, on the real. Y'all be safe. Peace.